Welcome to the LA Galaxy Countdown to First Kick. The LA Galaxy is presented by Herbalife, nutrition for a better life. And by Wingstop, the flavor of the LA Galaxy. Order now at wingstop.com. From a cold and wet Children's Mercy Park in Kansas City, Kansas, the LA Galaxy is on the air. Tonight, the Galaxy wrap up their two-game road trip to start the season, hoping to secure their first result on the young campaign. The Galaxy is still a bit short-handed without Javier Hernandez, which means Dejan Jovalich will get the start once again. That's not all bad. Jovalich put the Galaxy ahead in the 35th minute in Dallas last week. Getting him more opportunities is the key. Last time out, Jovalich only had two touches in the 18-yard box. That is not enough. Not for Jovalich, not for Hernandez, not for any forward. But what the Galaxy must clean up is defensive miscues. A lapse at the end of the first half gave up the lead, and a bad start to the second half, the Galaxy found themselves chasing en route to a 3-1 loss. Kansas City is also looking for their first win on the year, but they are two games in and have not yet scored a goal. Having said that, like the Galaxy, they've been without a DP, Johnny Russell. Something could give tonight. There were some good things from last week for the Galaxy. Jalen Neal, Preston Judd, Tyler Boyd all made their MLS debuts in Galaxy kits. And, of course, Jovalich's goal, we talked about that. All three fit in well and should get added minutes tonight. Now, Johnny Perez, he's returned to full training and most likely will be included in the 18 for this one. Weather will play a major factor here tonight. It has been cold. It has been raining. Both managers will adjust accordingly. When we return, we'll hear from manager Greg Vanny as he looks to get his club to take the next step forward in this one. It's the Galaxy on the road at Sporting Kansas City. More to come right after these words. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled-up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly. Imported by Crown Imports in Chicago, Illinois. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles, while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year. Powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. Like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. We 
welcome you back to the countdown to first kick. Galaxy at Sporting Kansas City. Kickoff is scheduled for 539 Pacific time. 39 degrees, 32 will be the low. It has been raining throughout the day, although Mother Nature might help out. No rain is in the forecast throughout this contest tonight, but it is the Midwest and you just never know. Time now for the injury report. It's brought to you by Dignity Health. The official health care partner of the L.A. Galaxy. When you're in good health, we all win. Now, the Galaxy without Chicharito once again. He's heading to week three of what could be five weeks with a hamstring injury. Douglas Costa also gone with a calf injury. Johnny Russell for Kansas City not able to go in this one. Why? Well, he's also nursing a hamstring injury and hasn't played through the first two games. Well, Greg Vanny spoke to the media ahead of this road trip. He had a chance to reflect on their opener and the loss at Dallas, 3-1. to one. And while they, they fell against FC Dallas, the Galaxy did have a good start to the match. Well, I thought there was, you know, there were some good moments uh, on the attacking side. Not enough, but there were some good moments. Uh, I thought the goal was a very good goal. Um, As the match wore on, his club got a little stretched in the midfield. Our wingers were a little too high. Uh, and so they were disjointed from the group when we were trying to build out, which made it very difficult for us to, to put together some numbers in the middle of the field. And so, you know, things like that lead, lead to the game just having a different vision than what we would want it to have. And then the Galaxy's defense lost its cohesiveness. Um, you know, defensively, I felt like at times we were just not transitioning fast enough to reorganize. We were. We were sometimes going to step out the close guys and we would have them in a good position and one guy would drop off just to, maybe to help with somebody else and they would find their way out and it became a little bit inefficient and so the game got vertical. Uh, also some turnovers where we were dribbling when we needed to spin out and keep possession we were dribbling into numbers against us which didn't make sense and again we we allowed for the game to get too up and down for for us and then we also didn't put enough numbers you know near the ball to be able to play in possession the way we want to and while the galaxy was trying to get to the half protecting its lead they let it slip away look ultimately the result in the first half the timeliness of this the goal we gave up was just it's a mistake that can't happen and they know that and we talked about it talked about it with raw because we could have got out of the half even though we weren't as perfect or great as we wanted to be we, sh we should have got out of the half 1-0 uh, that would have been a different emotion in the locker room and a different reorganization in the locker room so goals matter and when when goals happen also matter and that was that was a that was a tough one to take on the road it's not easy to to beat Dallas in Dallas or to score goals in Dallas. We gave, we gave them one at a bad time. With Mo now with the hometown Dallas, the Galaxy were touched for two more quick goals out of the half, and they never recovered from there. Tonight against Kansas City, the task is another tall one for the Galaxy, who continue without Chicharito. Historically, it has not been easy for the Galaxy here. Only nine wins in KC. They're kind of like a machine in a way. And uh, it's about taking away some of their strengths, about not making mistakes. Again, I think in some of these games for us is just to continue to be solid on the defensive side. Uh, you know, but going to Kansas City and playing them in their stadium and, and with the things they do and they have good players. It's, and, and like I said, Peter has them organized. They're a difficult team to play. Uh, so we've got to go and, and, again, try to do things better than we did the first week and improve on our performance. And... Uh, and not make the mistakes on, especially specifically, always, but on the road, it, they are really difficult to, to come back from sometimes. So we just got to be, we got to be better in those situations. And Greg Vanny talking about being tight in the back throughout that interview with the media earlier this week, and that's what he hopes to have tonight with his club. Kansas City on the opposite side hasn't scored a goal this season. They've played two games. They went 0-0 last time out against Colorado. Greg Vanny against Peter Ramiz in Sporting Kansas City as a manager. He is 0-5-4. So tonight could be a first. It will be a first, though, for one Galaxy member. When we come back, we'll get you the first 11, get you scores around Major League Soccer, and we'll get you ready for the Galaxy on the road at Sporting Kansas City. Stay with us. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the L.A. Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown L.A., St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, 
You can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. Hey, L.A. Galaxy fans. Score at Yamaba Resort and Casino at San Manuel and come experience world-class gaming, dining, and entertainment. As Southern California's home of huge prizes and jackpots, Yamaba is also the place to be for amazing concerts at Yamaba Theater. Upcoming shows include Maluma, Janet Jackson, New Kids on the Block, and many others. Get your tickets today at yamabatheater.com or the casino box office. Must be 21 to enter. Please gamble responsibly. In 1925... Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer, steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich, Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled-up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly. Imported by Crown Imports in Chicago, Illinois of a single game. LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year. Powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. Omega Accounting Solutions is a proud partner of the LA Galaxy. Omega empowers your business with expert guidance on government tax incentives. If your small business survived the pandemic, you could be eligible for a tax refund of up to $26,000 per employee. The Employee Retention Credit rewards businesses for paying staff during the pandemic. Omega ensures your business receives the maximum credit it deserves. Omega has over 15 years of experience and is a leading expert in the ERC and R&D tax credits. Discover if you you qualify in a free 10-minute ERC consultation. Visit OmegaTaxCredits.com for details. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Let's get your scores around Major League Soccer here as we count you down to the first kick of this one. Finals from earlier today, Atlanta defeated Charlotte by a count of 3-0. Dallas and Vancouver went 1-1. Dallas scored first. Vancouver scoring to even that match. At the half, Cincinnati and Seattle are 0-0. Halftime, D.C. United and Orlando also 0-0. Halftime, New York City leading Miami 1-0. Miami is 2-0 on the campaign. Approaching the half, Philadelphia and Chicago are 0-0. Also at the half, Toronto leading Columbus by a count of 1-0. So, a first for the Galaxy, a first for Jalen Neal. That is coming up for the young man. He is going to get his first Major League Soccer start tonight when the LA Galaxy play at Sporting Kansas City. The Galaxy 0-1 on the season. Sporting Kansas City 0-1-1 on the campaign. Kansas City hasn't scored a goal. The Galaxy have one to their credit, although they've conceded two on the campaign, losing three to one last time out. It is cold, it is wet, but the Galaxy need to do what they have to do, get a win on the road. Galaxy at Kansas City. It is coming up next. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. 
Spectrum internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit spectrummobile.com slash save for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich Pilsner style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from, it matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly, imported by Crown Imports in Chicago, Illinois. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles, while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year, powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. Win big with a free BRC burrito from El Pollo Loco and the LA Galaxy. At home games this season, when the Galaxy score before halftime, Loco Rewards members get a free BRC burrito with the purchase of a large drink. Download the Loco Rewards app and cheer on the Galaxy for your chance at a free BRC. Plus, enjoy Loco Rewards benefits like exclusive offers, points with every purchase, and even faster curbside pickup. El Pollo Loco, official partner of the LA Galaxy. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. We welcome you back here. We are moments away from the start of this one at Children's Mercy Park. Time now for the first 11 brought to you by Modelo, setting the gold standard for authentic Mexican beer since 1925. Modelo brewed for those with a fighting spirit. For the Galaxy in gold, Jonathan Bond will get the start once again. On the right side, Kelvin Leardam. He got an assist on that goal from Dejan Jovalich last week. Martin Caceres will get the start at the center back position alongside the youngster, 19-year-old Jalen Neal, makes his major league start for the Galaxy, major league soccer start for the Galaxy. Raheem Edwards will be on the left side at the center at the number five position and wearing the number five, the captain is Gaston Brugman. Flanking him at midfield will be Mark Delgado on the right and Ricky Pouge on the left. Right wing will be Efrain Alvarez wearing the number seven jersey and he picked up his first assist on the season last game in the secondary assist mode. Memo Rodriguez gets the start on the left side at forward and up top of course it'll be Dayan Jovalich who picked up his first goal of the campaign in the game at Dallas last time around. For Kansas City, John Poolskamp in goal. He had four saves in that 0-0 draw with Colorado from right to left defensively, Graham Zussi, Andre Ufontas, Robert Voloder, and Ben Sweat. The holding midfielder will be Remy Voltaire, flanking him, Eric Tommy, who is the captain of this club tonight, and Roger Espinoza, who has been around forever and most likely will put a bruise or two on Ricky Pouj tonight. Up top, it's going to be Kyrie Shelton, his 98th career appearance for Sporting Kansas City. And having said that, for Graham Zussi, number 398 in his long career with Sporting Kansas City. On the left side, Daniel Shallowy, who will stretch the Galaxy defense. They'll have to be aware of him making those runs on the left side, and he and Shelton will flip from time to time. And the center forward tonight is Willie Agata for Sporting Kansas City, who had 11 shots on goal last game against Colorado and came away with nothing in the back of the net. Galaxy 0-1-0, Sporting Kansas City 0-1-1. All time, these clubs, 26, 26, and 16. Though the Galaxy are just 9, 18, and 8 at Kansas City. Last time they won at KC, May 29th of 2019. Also a 
interesting one, a 2 nothing victory. But if you remember that particular night, the Galaxy flew in the night before. They were rerouted to St. Louis because of tornadoes in the Kansas City area. They had to fly in the day of. They got in about noon, took a small nap, went to Children's Mercy Park, and got the victory 2-0 with Zlatan Ibrahimovic as the forward for the Galaxy in that particular one. Kansas City all-time at home for home opener 16-3 at 8. And we are underway with Kansas City having the ball off the kickoff. It'll come back defensively, collected there by Beloder, and onto the right side for Graham Zussi, who sends it long into the Galaxy defense. The Galaxy wearing their L.A. kit tonight, making its debut the all-green with the gold and the red trim. Kansas City in the light blue with the dark blue trim. It's a foul against the Galaxy. Armando Villarreal is our referee. And the foul called against Efrain Alvarez. A free kick here for Sporting Kansas City. A damp pitch at Children's Mercy Park. We'll see how it holds up. Free kick will come right down the middle of the park. About 40 yards from goal. Tommy will stand over it. Jonathan Bond directing traffic as they'll line up middle right of his penalty area, about 19 yards away from goal. Tommy has that right foot that he'll set up. The one-man wall for the Galaxy is Ricky Pouj. And he'll knock it towards goal, a heavy ball, and on the bounce right into the chest of Jonathan Bond. And he'll pick up, walk to the top of his penalty area, and the Galaxy will break out. Caceres squares it on over to Jalen Neal. Many more starts to come for the young Jalen Neal, I believe. Pouge has it now for the Galaxy along the far side as he comes in towards center. Again, Neal on position. Pokes it forward. Gaston Brookman onto the near side. It comes Lear Dom. He'll play it up the near side. Tried to find Mark Delgado, and it's cleared out of play. I think Efrain Alvarez was brought down along the near side here. Galaxy want the foul. No foul is called. Peter Vermees, the manager in his 15th season for Sporting Kansas City, and right before the start of the campaign, was given a contract extension. Neal, under some pressure from Tommy, knocks it back to his goalkeeper, Bond. He'll play it ahead. Brugman. Back to Neal again in his own penalty area. Up the near side it goes. A turnover. Here's an opportunity. Shallowy in the Galaxy penalty area. Tries to play it across to the backside. The header towards goal. Over the bar and out of play. As Shelton got on the backside of that. Goal kick here for Jonathan Bond and the LA Galaxy. Early moments of this one. Kansas City with the first opportunity towards goal. Nice cross by Shallowy towards the backside. Shelton was there defending on the play. Raheem Edwards. And that ball over the bar and out. Galaxy off the restart, out the far side it goes. Kansas City puts the pressure on the Galaxy in their own zone. Galaxy tried to break it. Pouj dispossessed. It comes top of the box. Another shot towards net, this time by Shallowy. And it's saved again by Jonathan Bond, his second save of this campaign. And we are just three minutes in. Galaxy under pressure, could not break out. And Pouge unfortunately could not find the handle. It turned into a quick shot back the other way. Here's Brugman. Approaching the center circle. It'll come on back. Brugman once again. Pouge. Again, Brugman. In for Pouge one more time. Nowhere to go. And the Galaxy gave it away. Agata able to play it on the near side. The Galaxy, though, will get the throw in as Brugman plays it off of Tommy. And a throw in here in front of the Galaxy player bench. Fourth official, Rosendo Mendoza. And the VAR tonight is Edvin Yurasevich. Jalen Neal. He'll play it on the left side, finds Edwards, just shy of the midfield stripe. Ahead it goes to Memo Rodriguez, back to Edwards defensively. Caceres in some trouble to his goalkeeper, Bond. He's pressed by Agata, lifts it off the near side. Lear Dom. He'll bring it on down, watched there by one defender in Tommy. 
Alvarez back into center Delgado. This will come to Brugman who tried to flip it onto the left side for Rodriguez. Zussi steps in front of that. He goes direct down the middle of the park. Agata is there. Neil defended on the play. Shallow he's dropped, but the referee says play on. Comes onto the right side. The cross into the area. Tommy on the left side has it now. Watch there by Lear Dom. Galaxy in a bit of trouble right now. It comes back on out. Another ball in for Tommy. And the Galaxy do a good job this time forcing Kansas City back on out towards midfield. Tommy once again now inside 30 thinking about the shot closed off by Delgado. Caceres able to disrupt the play as well. The Galaxy will come out with possession. Pouge in for Delgado. Stripped of the ball right at the stripe. The Galaxy right now stuck in their own end. Left side of the go. Here comes Daniel Shallowy now for Sporting Kansas City. Plays it on top of the box. Agata back out. It goes to Tommy about 25 away from goal. Espinosa's attempt at net right onto the goalkeeper Jonathan Bond at the goal line and his third save early on for the L.A. Galaxy. Roger Espinosa been around for quite some time in Major League Soccer. Good defensive midfielder. And he keeps trucking along. Caceres. Brugman now for the Galaxy. Here's Jalen Neal. Ahead it goes to Pooj, back to Neal. He'll switch it on over. Brugman once again. Caceres left of him. Brugman approaches the center strike. Flies it, play it through. Broken up once again. Here comes the counter. Agata lays it off. Tommy pushing forward. He's got Shallowy to his left. Tommy into the area and out to the left side it goes. Shallowy on his right foot plays it back post. Edwards is there to clear it away. Not far enough. Another ball into the Galaxy penalty box. Finally cleared by Lear Dom. Alvarez pickpocketed and the Galaxy in some trouble here in the early moments. Inside seven minutes is still 0-0 though Kansas City showing that they are very dangerous in this one so far. On the right side it'll go. Zussi pushing forward this time. Edwards comes out to defend. He'll get through him. Zussi does. The attempt to cross is blocked by Rodriguez and out of play. Throw in for Sporting Kansas City. Graham Zussi will take it. He's known for long throws. This will act like a corner kick. Standing room only at Children's Mercy Park here for the home opener for Sporting Kansas City. And I believe they're checking the replay maybe for a handball, but that went off the back of Memo Rodriguez. Another throw in. Yovel is yet to touch the ball in this match. Alvarez has a check back in order to get on possession. Galaxy want a handball here on Tommy, and play has been stopped and possession back to the LA Galaxy. Tommy says, No, 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 left chest. The referee said, No, that's a handball. So possession back to the Galaxy here. Absolutely, that left arm was out as we see it again on the replay. Caceres this time for the Galaxy. Able to play it up the left side. He'll find Edwards. Pouge in some trouble. Bracketed by two defenders. Back it goes to Neal. One times it over to Brugman. He'll take it towards the stripe once again. Brugman tries to play it on through to Jovalich. This comes to Efrain Alvarez. This is promising for the Galaxy. Memo Rodriguez. Left footed ball. It comes across. Saved by Pools Camp. And he pushes it just beyond the late running Mark Delgado. And we continue here 0 0. A shot there by Memo Rodriguez down low, and Poles Camp did well with his first save on the night. Unfortunately for the Galaxy, Delgado is already beyond the play when that rebound came out to his former position. Brugman now for L.A. as the Galaxy try to settle in after that early pressure from Kansas City. He'll play it up the left wing. Rodriguez does well to bring it down. Looks up, gets the cross into the area. Jovalich looking to settle. It'll skip on through him and out of play. And a goal kick for John Poolscamp and Sporting Kansas City. Ball 
will go right side. The Galaxy press high. Kansas City having a little difficult time getting out of their own penalty area now as it comes over towards the near side. Shallow E now. Defensive side of midfield. Lifts it long into the Galaxy defense. Jalen Neal is there. Back to his goalkeeper to go. Collected there by Bond. He'll lift in the midfield. Again, Shallowy able to play this one on forward. Galaxy break it. Rodriguez. You'll find Jovalic. Cool, calm, and collected is Jovalic. Back to Caceres. Brugman. And Jalen Neal once again. This is better from the Galaxy as they withstood a hurricane from Sporting Kansas City to start the match. Three saves in the early moments from Jonathan Bond. Nothing too spectacular, but certainly they were shots on goal. One header went over the crossbar. Now the Galaxy are evening things out just a bit. Edwards chopped down. That's a foul on Shelton and a free kick for the Galaxy. Chasing this ball down Delgado. It'll come on loose at midfield. Alvarez trying to get it back and cannot. Kansas City comes out with possession. Zusi lifts this one long into the Galaxy defense on the far side. Chasing down is Caceres. It'll go out of play over the far side touch and throw it. As Agata is brought down, it's going to be throwing for Sporting Kansas City. Galaxy thought possession to them, but no. And Kansas City will get the throw, and Zussi again will run up and take it. This will be a long throw into the Galaxy penalty area. Graham Zussi. Again, messing with the far side. AR puts it down for a free kick, and the AR has to tell him, no, pick it up, take the throw in. Tommy back out to Zussi, looking to get the cross away off the defender in Delgado, out of play over the end line. First corner of the night for KC. It'll come from the right side. Eric Tommy will take it one more time. Inside 13 minutes of play. Thank you for joining us at LAGalaxy.com and the Galaxy YouTube channel this evening. Galaxy are back at home next week when they open up the home campaign. It seems like forever and a day. The Galaxy have been able to play in front of the home crowd. This will be on the Tommy's right foot. He'll bend it away from the goalkeeper. It goes top of the six, and the redirect towards goal is over the bar. And out of play. Touch last by the Galaxy. Fontas was there. Apparently off of Jalen Neal as it went over the bar. Here's Tommy one more time. Top of the six it goes. Knocked away this time by Brookman. Back to the top of the box. Cleared away by Jalen Neal. Job by Rodriguez settles this for Efrain Alvarez. Alvarez stripped of the ball and out of play. Touched last by Sporting Kansas City. Voltaire able to get to this one. Throw in here for the Galaxy. Neil back to Caceres. Edwards under some pressure. Forced back to his goalkeeper, Bond. He'll lift in towards midfield. Knocked away by Espinosa. Second ball brought down by Jovalic. This will be interference by a referee, I believe, in possession to the LA Galaxy. Actually, an offside on the other side of it against LA. And over and back, according to our referee, Armando Villarreal. And Kansas City comes out with possession. They'll push towards the left side and into the Galaxy half of midfield. Near side it comes. Leibold 
able to play up the fars near side I should say and it finds the end line and it's going to be a goal kick for Jonathan Bond in the Galaxy too much there for Eric Tommy who's been very busy here in the first quarter hour for Sporting Kansas City they have been playing through him throughout this first 15 minutes and he's been the one orchestrating things for them in the offensive third. Here's Lerdam now on the short goal kick. It comes up the near side. Alvarez is there in some trouble as he's forced back into his own defensive third once again. Lerdam in towards center. Brugman as the Galaxy try to get around this pressure from Kansas City and they'll lose possession again. Agata out to the right side for Shelton. Too long. It'll find its way to the touchline and a throw in here for the L.A. Galaxy. Reminder, Galaxy fans, 2023 season ticket memberships are available now. Season ticket memberships include brand new benefits, including access to the MLS season pass on the Apple TV app. Don't miss out on a moment of the home action. The L.A. Galaxy are for L.A. by L.A. Join now by calling 877-3-GALAXY or go to LAGalaxy.com forward slash season tickets for more information. 0-0 zero, zero here. Inside 16 minutes, Kansas City's been busy, especially in the first 10 with five shots towards the Galaxy goal. Three of them were on net. Jonathan Bond with three saves. Galaxy have the one shot that forced John Poleskamp to go down to his left and parry that ball into his penalty area. And we're still 0-0 early moments of this contest. Kansas City putting the pressure on the Galaxy. And the Galaxy slowly evening things out as they work through the middle third here this ball ahead intended for Yobel it's too much on it comes back to Pools camp and he'll pick up and play it forward. Another loose ball almost won there by Memo Rodriguez Galaxy do win it at midfield by Delgado and then cleared away. This will be a foul on Lear Dom as he goes over the top of Eric Tommy and a free kick for Sporting Kansas City. And of course, Peter Vermees, any opportunity he gets, would like to have a caution card out for his club's benefit, but not this time around, I don't believe. Although Lear Dom has a discussion with our referee, Mr. Villarreal. Don't believe the yellow card. Well, this could have been a yellow card easily as we look at the replay once again. A little reckless there on the part of Lear Dom. We continue play and it comes back to Jonathan Bond. They'll have it top of the 18 yard box. Jonathan Bond in this match in the early going. Here's Brookman. Watch there by Agata as the Galaxy build out of the back. Jalen Neal this time around. Lays it off to Mark Delgado who checks back. Played it towards the near side stripe. And it'll come on back to Delgado. Put Lear Dom in some bad position there. They pass the ball beyond. And the Galaxy are passing the ball in front of the defenders. And that's making it hard on their teammates. You do a better job of that. Another throw in here for Kansas City on the right side. Zussi. It'll come in towards center. Leibold able to play this ahead. It'll come on back to Leibold one more time. Having said all that, the Galaxy are doing a good job of staying compact down the middle of the park and not getting stretched. So it's OK to ugly the match up once in a while. And that's probably what the Galaxy are doing at the moment. And that's OK. Here's Pooj. Squares it along the stripe. It comes near side Lear Dom. Back to Neal. Pooj once again Lear Dom and back to Ricky Pooj. It'll come to Neal. He's able to play it on forward. Delgado. Put a little mustard on this one. Back to Caceres. The Galaxy quickly move over to the left side. Edwards. Back to Brugman it goes. Long pass on the left side again for Edwards. 
You put on the brakes, puts it back on his right, cuts it towards the end line, tries to get this cross away and does down low off of Fontas and over to the far side. Edwards keeps it alive. Was he brought down in the area? The referee says no. And we will continue from here. Not enough contact there. Raheem had a tough first night against FC Dallas. Looking to atone for that. Having said that, I think the Galaxy itself, after 44 minutes, struggled the rest of that night in Dallas. It's a good start so far for L.A. defensively. And they're picking their spots going forward. And that's okay. Here's Shelton now at the stripe for Kansas City. Right side it goes to Zussi. Early ball towards the Galaxy penalty area. It bounces on to Jonathan Bond, and he'll collect it on the far side of his six-yard box. Zero zero here inside 21 minutes of play. Edwards. This ball ahead intended for Jovalic is broken up. Veloder. Leibold. Kansas City on possession. Galaxy flew out on Thursday. They trained Friday in frigid conditions. Got themselves, I guess, used to the environment, although I'm not sure how much you can get used to 30 degree weather. But they're doing all right tonight here in a 0 0 contest, 22 minutes in. Voloder. It'll come on over. Fontas. Back to Voloder, right side, Zussi as the Galaxy put some pressure on, although that was broken. On to the right side it goes, intended for Shelton. Good defensive work there on the part of Caceres. It'll be a throw in for Kansas City. Quickly taken. Espinoza, he'll knock it on back. Zussi is there. Switched on over, looking for Leibold. He can't find it. It'll go out of play. Throw in here for the LA Galaxy. Soccer fans, secure your 2023 partial plan now. Partial plans include the March 18th home opener, April 16th game versus LAFC, plus four games of your choice. Partial plans also include a 10% discount at the team store and pre-sale access and discounts for MLS playoffs. Email ticket plans at LAGalaxy.com or visit LAGalaxy.com forward slash tickets forward slash partial plan today. Possession back to Sporting Kansas City here at midfield. The foul against Dayan Jovalich. Both players were going for the ball there. I don't think Jovalich did anything wrong as both players stuck their leg out. Edwards will win this one now for the Galaxy. Top of the defensive third. Ahead it goes the Brookman. He'll get through midfield, but then. Back to the goalkeeper, pulls camp, it goes, and Kansas City on possession. Fontas. He's got Liable on the near side if he wants him. Jovalich will close him down. The pass ahead right into Leerdam, and the Galaxy have it again. Kosseris this time. Defensive side of the circle, lays it off to Edwards. He'll square it on over to Jalen Neal. Again, Kosseris. Neo on possession. He'll walk towards the midfield stripe. Tries to play it ahead to Memo Rodriguez and does. It comes on back to Brugman. Square it on over towards the far side to Pouge. Top of the center circle. He'll take it center. Now plays it on forward. Alvarez with the ball for the Galaxy. Puts it back onto his left foot. Back in towards center. Pouge. He'll find Brugman. Rodriguez once more. A little heavy on that ball. In for Jovalich. He got it on back. 
And the second pass cleared out. And here comes Kansas City on the attempted counterattack. Nice job by Ricky Pooge. Stepped up into that counter and broke it up. And the Galaxy have it one more time. Alvarez. A quick turn there trying to find Jovalich. Maybe a little more patience there by Efrain. Looked like he might have had a little more time. And that'll work its way through. Here comes Kansas City now the counterattack. Back the other way. Espinoza goes right side. Here's Shelton. Right corner of the Galaxy penalty area. Good work there by Edwards. Stands him up. He gets a little help from Delgado. This ball back in towards center. Leibold getting front forward. Although this time around it comes from Fontas. Here's the cross into the area. It comes on through. Not cleared out though. Zussi tries to cut in onto his left foot. Takes a shot over the bar and out of play. And that's a goal kick for Jonathan Bond and the LA Galaxy. Inside 26 minutes of play. Still 0-0 here. Kansas City setting the pace of this match. And you expected it for the home team. But the Galaxy doing okay defensively. Compact taking care of business a referee says that ball was deflected so a corner kick here for Kansas City once again the third one of the night but this one will come from the left side this time around it'll bend in towards goal so look for Fontas Veloder and Shelton to crash Jonathan Bond's net Shelton's on the backside Fontas right at center being marked by Jalen Neal Tommy Lifts into the area. Nice job by Bond batting that ball away, but not far enough. Shallow. He plays it out. Here's Kansas City again. Zussi from 30. This ball's blocked. Comes top of the box once again. Veloder plays it out the right side. Here's the cross into the area. Back post it'll come. Tommy is there. Side of the 18 yard box. Plays it towards the back and brought down by Jonathan Bond. He'll take some time now Jonathan Bond will to slow things down a bit for the Galaxy. A lot of side to side in front of his 18 yard box. And Bond did well to pull that cross out of the air and slow things for a moment for his Galaxy side. As the ball will come to midfield. Pooj is there for L.A. Rodriguez. Started out as the left winger for the Galaxy but he's dropped into center with Pooj and Brugman underneath him. And now some pressure here. Brugman played it back to Bond. Put him in trouble. Jonathan Bond cleared into midfield. And here comes Kansas City again. Tommy side of the six. Played it near post. And that was deflected and then saved by Bond and out of play. Another corner kick here for Sporting Kansas City. Their fourth one of the evening. Eric Tommy was able to get that shot away to the near post. It may have been wide. Actually looking at the replay once again. A good job on the part of Jonathan Bond. Getting those fists on the ball and clearing that ball out. Another ball that's going to bend in towards goal. Tommy goes to the backside this time. Bond gets on the end of it. Foul is called inside the six. And this time against Sporting Kansas City as I believe. Caceres was pushed from behind right into his goalkeeper as we look at it again on the replay and well, I'm not so sure about that honestly but the foul is called and a free kick for the Galaxy and we'll continue here. Not sure that there was enough contact there. There would have been a foul against Sporting Kansas City unless Unless it was a hand to the face and that's what the Galaxy trainers are looking at right now. It looks like on the right side of Martin Caceres's face. Greg Vanny having a little discussion with his midfielders. He wants things to settle down a little bit. The Galaxy have been absorbing a lot in the first 28 minutes of play and that's honestly expected here tonight. It's the home opener for Kansas City. They do very well at home 16 3 and 8 all time and at Children's Mercy Park since it's open 5 1 and 6 in home openers. So they're a difficult team to play in their building and for the Galaxy 
absorbing this pressure right now and keeping it at zero is not a bad thing for them and for anybody as the road team. As we look at the replay once again here. Not sure where Kosaras took the shot. It might have been. It might have been just the elbow of Jonathan Bond as he went up high to clear out the ball into a six. Nonetheless it's going to be possession to the Galaxy. Kosaras will have to go off for now. He's like a boxer there. He got a little bit of Vaseline put over that eye that took the shot. Galaxy players all huddled up the, the reserves on their bench. Double jackets and scarves covering not only their their necks but also the lower parts of their face. Try to stay as warm as possible. Here's Neil. Ahead it goes to Brugman. He'll play back to Casares who's back on the pitch. Pouge ushers this one forward to Edwards. He'll switch it on over. Nice job by Efrain winning it back for the Galaxy. Ahead it comes to Delgado. They're down. Back to the strike. Neil is there. He's got Kasser if, if he wants him. He'll play it on over to him. The veteran of four World Cups. Delgado. Over to Pouge. Pushes this one forward. Efrain. Watch there by Shallowy. Taking off the ball. Good job by the Galaxy though. Stepping up. And slowing the counterattack. Kansas City has it, but they'll have to work it out of the back. Fontas squares it on over and played on to the right side. Zussi now for Sporting Kansas City. Kyrie Shelton at the stripe will cut in towards center. Top of the center circle will come on back. Spray to the left side. Shallowy with some time and space. Early ball and in the area switched on to the right side. Knotted down in front for Agata and cleared out of play by Brugman. And Kansas City gets another corner kick now. Number five, I believe, by my count. This one will come from the right side and should bend away from Jonathan Bond's goal. Roger Espinoza right in front of Gaston Brugman, near side of the six. Voltaire is there as well, and he will now peel the way. Here's Tommy. Lifts it to the area, flicked onto the near post, saved by Jonathan Bond, and no rebound. Good job by Bond that time. In the right place at the right time, he just positioned well, got both hands on it, took it to ground. Roger Espinoza got on the end of that one, I believe. Here's Caceres from the Galaxy, from Pouge. Here's Ricky Pouge. Lays it off for Rodriguez. Flicks this one forward. Too much on that one. I think it was intended for Mark Delgado. Galaxy doing a lot of interchanging when they go forward. But that first pass that comes from midfield for that interchange when it goes forward, it has to hit its mark. That allows for the rotation that the Galaxy are trying to exercise to develop. Once that first pass, though, from midfield forward misses, Galaxy are back on their heels. And they are right now. Here's Shallowy on the left side. Plays it back out. Fontas in some trouble. Pooj trying to get this one back, and he does. Good work there by Ricky. Back it goes to Alvarez. Plays this one out to Brugman. This is promising for the Galaxy. They'll go back right side. Delgado, two defenders around him at the near side touch. He'll get the throw in out of this as Leibold knocks it out. Throw in here for L.A. Clear down. Over to Caceres. Edwards, and back it goes. Ricky Pooge right at the stripe. He'll go near side, Leardom once again. 
on the near side for Alvarez. Back it goes. Not a good pass there by Efra. Here comes the counterattack back the other way. Tommy with Agata. Tommy still with it. Plays it on over to Agata. Gets away from him. And the Galaxy very fortunate that time. Both players, Tommy and Agata, taking the same path to goal. And Tommy was the ball, the man who had the ball. Agata's got to do a better job of pulling the defenders with him. Galaxy Fortune at that time around. Jovalich taking off the ball here. Espinoza on possession. Knocks this one on back. Comes out to the near side. Leibold. Watch there by Alvarez. Force back. This will be collected. Fontas back to his goalkeeper. Pulls camp. Who's made one nice save so far in this first half. Fontas side of his penalty area. He'll lift in the midfield. Knocked down there by Caceres. Ahead it goes to Brugman. He's dispossessed. And here comes Sporting Kansas City back the other way. Right down the middle of the park. The Galaxy gets some numbers back. Tommy outside the 18 trying to go to the back post. Blocked by Jalen Neal and cleared away. Alvarez once again for the Galaxy. That ball needs to get off his foot. He's got three defenders around him. It'll come on loose. And Kansas City has it again. Voltaire. Over to Shallowy. Back out it goes. Voltaire and on the near side. Tommy. Leibold again for Kansas City. And they'll work the near side. Again, Tommy rotating towards center. Tried to play it across. Edwards gets on the first ball. Zussi will run it down. Plays it back into midfield. Everybody behind the line defending for the Galaxy right now. Leibold. All the way back to Pools Camp. It'll be lifted towards the near side. Shallowy gets on the first ball. Able to play it back for Eric Tommy, who's doing a very good job of keeping the ball on his foot. This time, though, an errant pass picked off by Puj. Plays it into space, looking for Jovalich. Good heads up play on the part of Jovalich, trying to find Memo Rodriguez, but a little too direct to goal, allowing for the goalkeeper Pools Camp to come off his line and pick it up at the 18. Espinosa now for Sporting Kansas City. Past the center circle, lays it off for Zussi. Comes back. Voloder back to Leibel on the left. Watch there by Alvarez. The Galaxy may be giving up a, too much space, a bigger cushion defensively with the man who has the ball. They need to close that person down quickly. Two guys on the ball make it a little bit more difficult. Galaxy are absorbing a lot right now. and We're in the 37th minute, heading into the 38th. Voloder at the stripe, knocks it on back. Comes over to Fontas now. Near side Leibold's. The Galaxy pressure a little higher. And they'll get the turnover at midfield. Although Mark Delgado's ball right into Voltaire. Mark working hard to get it on back. Memo Rodriguez settles. Ricky Pouge now trying to push on forward. He's dispossessed. It'll come on to the near side. Leibold for Kansas City. Head to Shallowy. Both clubs. Around that middle third right now, just knocking the ball around and having turnovers after two and three passes and having to rebuild. Zussi on the right side now, watched by Memo Rodriguez for Sporting Kansas City on possession. Espinoza towards center, knocks it ahead for Agata. He's about 30 yards away from goal, goes left side to Shallowy. Outside the left corner of the area, flights this one towards the spot, the header by Agata, and another save by Jonathan Bond, although that one. An easy one for Bond as it floated towards his goal. That's a tough header on the part of Agata as the ball was just lobbed into the area. So he's got to get up high and get as much on it to get it past the goalkeeper and very difficult on the part of Agata to do. Galaxy have the possession advantage in this match. And I'm not surprised at that at all. Sporting Kansas City is all about the counterattack and all about going direct to goal. Here's Pouge pushing forward, trying to find Jovalich. This ball will be cleared out, but the Galaxy keep it alive on the far side. Memo Rodriguez. Edwards. Brookman squared in towards center Delgado. He'll find Pouge. 
turns it forward, tried to flick it on forward to Edwards. Not a good pass there by Ricky. And it'll be cleared back the other way. Leibold. He'll push past the midfield stripe on the left side, taking up the space the Galaxy give him. Leibold on top of the area. He'll get it on back to Shallowy. Back to Shallowy one more time. Now on his right foot, sends it towards goal, bounces around. Se second ball is shot and is blocked by Jalen Neal. And the shot by Shallowy there. The Galaxy again stuck in their own area. Tommy this time. Neal will win it, but he can't clear the box. And it comes out the near side. Leibold again. For Sporting Kansas City. The Galaxy giving up opportunity after opportunity at the moment. Jonathan Bond will pull the cross out of the air and he'll settle things down for the moment. 0 0 inside 40 minutes of play. Need to clean things up, the Galaxy do. Had a couple of unforced errors there but from the man in green tonight. And that is the LA Galaxy with the LA kit making its debut. Brugman. Near side it comes to Neal back in towards center to Pouge, taken off the ball by Espinoza. Ahead it goes to Agata. He plays on the left side, Shallowy. Pouge getting back defensively. Shallowy cuts it back onto his right. Back in towards center it goes. Tommy lays it off to Espinoza. Right side, Zusi. Watch there by Edwards. Looking for Shelton. Shelton, right side of the Galaxy penalty area, turning on Caceres into the six. He goes, and Brugman will come out with possession. Nice job by Gaston for the LA Galaxy. Delgado, back to Brugman one more time. He'll lift into midfield as the Galaxy try to break out. Efrain Alvarez runs it down the right side. He's by himself. Jovalich now makes the run towards center. Here's the ball in for Memo Rodriguez, who was making the late run, and it's cleared away to the far side. Delgado plays it on back. Edwards will have to run it down and has it now for the Galaxy. Knocks it back to his goalkeeper, Bond. He'll collect. Neal. Over to Edwards. And while the Galaxy have done a good job of keeping Kansas City off the scoreboard, they have been working hard to do that. Neal has it now for the Galaxy. Over to Pouj at the stripe. Able to play it forward to Memo Rodriguez. Jovalich making the run. However, it'll come back to Pouj instead. Ricky in some trouble again, dispossessed. And a little more awareness there for the Galaxy number eight or the eight player. Here comes Tommy into the area now for Sporting Kansas City. He plays it across the six down hard low to the back post. And it's out of play. And this will be a goal kick for the Galaxy. Another turnover in midfield. And that's what the Galaxy need to clean up quickly. Now I'm sure if it's the cold that's getting to Ricky or just the awareness of the players around him. But he needs to be a little quicker right now, getting that ball off his foot or breaking the line. One or the two. But when he turns away from the play, Kansas City makes him pay and they close him down. Here's Caceres now. Neal over to Brugman. Ahead to Ricky Pouge, closed again quickly by Shelton. Ricky does well that time. On the near side, it comes to Leerdam. Back it goes to Neal, and he'll play it on over. Caceres on the squared ball. He's got Edwards to his left if he wants him. Lays it off to Brookman instead. 44th minute. Pouge able to play it ahead. Memo Rodriguez on the left side. It goes to Edwards. Again, Brookman. Pouge this time around. With the outside of his right foot, finds Memo Rodriguez. Tried to play it through for Jovalic. That's broken up by Veloder. It'll come back into midfield, and here comes Kansas City on the counterattack once again. Shelton able to play it ahead to Agata. He'll go right side. Shelton will run into the area. He's got Shallowy as well. Goes top of the box intended for Tommy. Good job by Alvarez getting in front. Now the shot from distance. Great save by Bond as he bats it over the bar and out of play. Jonathan Bond keeping the Galaxy in this one on a blistering shot from Voltaire about 30 yards from goal going up high and Bondi getting that right arm up and over the bar goes corner kick sporting Kansas City
It'll come from the right side as we enter the 45th minute. We will have at least by by my by my count two minutes of stoppage time. Remember the injury to Caceres. So that would give us probably about two minutes of stoppage time and maybe a little more. We'll see what the officials decide. Zero zero here. Corner number six to the top of the box it comes. Leibold miss hit that one terribly and it goes out of play. It'll be a goal kick for Jonathan Bond. Well the L.A. kit honors our home and its history by embracing our colors the colors of Los Angeles the city's flag rock with us in your very own available now at the L.A. Galaxy team store. They sold out the night they were unveiled at the Jersey launch but they are available now at the L.A. Galaxy team store at Dignity Health Sports Park and when you're here at Dignity Health Sports Park for the opener next week against Vancouver. Check it out. Throw in for Kansas City. Two minutes of stoppage time. Knocked away by Edwards. Although KC on possession. Played out the left side. It goes. Shallow wave. Watch there by Ledom. Good job by Kelvin closing him down that time around. However, Kansas City on possession once again. It'll come towards the near side. Eric Tommy. Just inside the touchline, cuts it in towards center, flights it towards the far side. Zussi will bring it down about 30 yards from goal. Back out it goes. Espinoza again towards the near side. The Galaxy just need to get to the break here. One minute and 10 seconds or so before we get to the break. Voltaire. Voloder. Defensive side of the circle. Over to Fontas once again. Ricky Puj puts the pressure on, forces the ball back. Jovalic there to help him out. Out the far side it goes. Voloder has to go back to his goalkeeper, Pools Camp. This is good from the LA Galaxy. About 45 seconds to go unofficially before the break. If they could hold it to the break, that's something to build on for the second half. Long ball coming in, cleared away by Caceres over the far side. Touch, throw in for Kansas City. Zussi quickly takes it. Over to Espinoza. Lights it towards the back side of the Galaxy defense. Near side it comes. Tommy onto his right foot. Winds up to the back post. Saved by Bond. Bats it out the far side. Another shot coming in and blocked by Caceres. Zussi tries to send it on through. Was that ball in play? Apparently it stays in play. And Jonathan Bond picks it up. And that should probably do it for the first half here. As the Galaxy under a lot of pressure from Sporting Kansas City. As our referee Armando Villarreal has whistled the end of 45. Five minutes of play. Jonathan Bond, with about five saves in the first half, has kept the Galaxy in this one. 0 0 as 45 minutes have come and gone at Children's Mercy Park. As the Galaxy will go into the locker room, warm up a little bit. We'll make some tactical changes coming out for the second half. But right now, they're level at zero. Halftime is coming up next. Stay with us. The course of a single game. LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year, powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save for details. Hey, L.A. Galaxy fans. Score at Yamaha Resort and Casino at San Manuel and come experience world-class gaming, dining, and entertainment. As Southern California's home of huge prizes and jackpots, Yamaha is also the place to be for amazing concerts at Yamaha Theater. Upcoming shows include Maluma, Janet Jackson, New Kids on the Block, and many others. Get your tickets today at YamahaTheater.com or the casino box office. Must be 21 to enter. Please gamble responsibly. 
Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. Omega Accounting Solutions is a proud partner of the LA Galaxy. Omega empowers your business with expert guidance on government tax incentives. If your small business survived the pandemic, you could be eligible for a tax refund of up to $26,000 per employee. The Employee Retention Credit rewards businesses for paying staff during the pandemic. Omega ensures your business receives the maximum credit it deserves. Omega has over 15 years of experience and is a leading expert in the ERC and R&D tax credits. Discover if you qualify in a free 10-minute ERC consultation. Visit OmegaTaxCredits.com for details. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop, but you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. This L.A. Galaxy Halftime is brought to you by Wingstop, the flavor of the L.A. Galaxy. Order now at Wingstop.com. For the L.A. Galaxy in this one for Bond, 18 shots towards his goal. Eight of them were on net. Eight saves in the first half for Jonathan Bond. And he's kept it at level at zero and zero heading into the second half. The Galaxy need to do a better job of refraining from turning the ball over at midfield. They need to force Kansas City to build out of the back and thus give themselves an opportunity to win balls in midfield and put Sporting Kansas City under pressure. Galaxy had only one shot, one shot on goal. John Polskamp came up with a nice save, keeping the Galaxy out of his net. But in the second half, though, they cannot keep the ball tilted towards the Galaxy goal. Too many opportunities against Jonathan Bond, even though the Galaxy goalkeeper right now has put up player of the week numbers with eight saves inside 45 minutes. A lot of work to be done, but they've given themselves a chance. It's 0-0. When we come back, we'll take a look at scores around Major League Soccer, and we'll get you ready for the second half right after these words. Stay with us. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles, while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year, powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer, steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich, Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled-up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from, it matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly, imported by Crown Imports in Chicago, Illinois. 
Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Time continues here, 0 0 at Children's Mercy Park between the Galaxy and Sporting Kansas City. If you look at the stats, they're pretty even. But when you watch the game and the way it's been played, Sporting Kansas City has enjoyed all the attacking opportunities in the Galaxy half and in the Galaxy's defensive third. And the one stat that may be able to put this into vision is the crossing percentage. 41.2% per of the possessions for Sporting Kansas City have led to crosses, which means they're in and around the Galaxy penalty box. The Galaxy have had zero percentages in, in terms of crosses around the Sporting Kansas City penalty area. They've only had one chance in and around that penalty area, and that was the shot by Memo Rodriguez that led to the save for John Poolscamp. Scores around Major League Soccer. These finals are in. Atlanta defeated Charlotte by a count of 3 0. Vancouver and Dallas were 1-1. Orlando and D.C. played to a 1-1 draw. And Toronto and Columbus 1-1 the final there. Now to the games in progress. Cincinnati leading Seattle in the 97th minute right now, 1-0. In the 96th, New York City over Miami, 1-0. Both of those teams on the losing end about two about to pick up their first losses of the year. Philadelphia in the 90th minute, one nothing over Chicago. That game in frigid Philadelphia tonight. Minnesota at the half. They're playing with the orange ball in Minnesota, leading Red Bull New York by a count of one nothing. Also at the half, it is Nashville 1 and Montreal nothing. Here, 0-0 zero, zero between the Galaxy and Sporting Kansas City. 45 minutes to go. And can the Galaxy earn all three points away? We'll find out in a moment. Stay with us. The second half is next. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer, steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich, Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage in their rolled up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from, it matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly, imported by Crown and Courts in Chicago, Illinois. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. 
Hey, LA Galaxy fans. Score at Yamaba Resort and Casino at San Manuel and come experience world-class gaming, dining, and entertainment. As Southern California's home of huge prizes and jackpots, Yamaba is also the place to be for amazing concerts at Yamaba Theater. Upcoming shows include Maluma, Janet Jackson, New Kids on the Block, and many others. Get your tickets today at yamabatheater.com or the casino box office. Must be 21 to enter. Please gamble responsibly. of a single game. LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year. Powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed Wingstop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Time now for the second half of our contest. This LA Galaxy match is brought to you by Herbalife, nutrition for a better life. Second half is moments away from Children's Mercy Park and taking a look at the Galaxy bench and what Greg Vanny might look at in the second half. Preston Judd maybe for some hold-up play. He might even join Jovalich up there and let Jovalich play underneath him and Judd play as the target. We'll see how that goes. In terms of wide play, and maybe if the Galaxy get to a point where they feel that they can stretch the game a bit, you're looking at Johnny Perez, who could make his season debut tonight as a winger on the right side, replacing Efrain Alvarez, if that happens. And Tyler Boyd, who did play at FC Dallas, I expect him to get minutes in this second half at some point. Defensively for the Galaxy, if they need to shore things up down the middle, look at Yuri Rossell, possibly to join Gaston Brugman if they decide to go with two holding midfielders and allowing Ricky Pouge to push forward and be more of an offensive creator. Daniel Laguerre might come in on the right side or also help plug up the middle for the Galaxy, depending on how the game goes. But right now, if you're Greg Vanny, even though you have conceded the shots on goal and your goalkeeper, Jonathan Bond, has stood tall and taken care of you, you're feeling okay about things. You get into the second half and you say, all right, we've taken their best shot. They've hit us on the chin a few times, but we have not gone down for the count. We haven't conceded anything. We have 45 minutes to go on the road, and we are 0-0 with these guys. A little better possession in the offensive end and cleaner in the middle third. Too many turnovers in the middle third for the Galaxy, creating offensive opportunities for Sporting Kansas City. You clean that up, your offense looks a lot better, and Sporting Kansas City has to respect you a little bit more. Kansas City comes out, they huddle about 40 yards away from their goal. Galaxy getting ready to go here on a very cold night in Kansas City, Kansas. No substitutions to start this second half for the Galaxy at the moment. No surprise there. And Peter Vermees going with his first 11 as well. He's got to be pleased with the way his club has played. I'm sure he's telling them in the locker room, the opposing goalkeeper made eight saves in the first half. He's kept them in this game. Otherwise, we, Sporting Kansas City, should be blowing these guys out. I'm sure that was the type of message Peter Vermees said. Most likely he said, keep on doing the same thing and watch your backside. Second half is underway. The Galaxy with the ball off the kickoff. They defend the goal to our right and attack from right to left. Edwards with it, able to play it back to Caceres. Switches it across to Lirdam. Everybody along the back line now gets in touch with Jalen Neal. Over to Caceres once again. Now Kansas City will press up high. Edwards will push up the near side. This one will find its way over the touch line for a throw in Kansas City right at midfield. Graham Zussi, the veteran, 398 appearances for Sporting Kansas City. Quite a career. 
Ball will come loose as Memo Rodriguez has it now. Tries to play this one over to Ricky Pooge, and he's taken off the ball by Voltaire. It'll come on over to Voloder and back to his goalkeeper, Pools Camp. Not a good ball there by Pools Camp. Voloder has to clear it quickly. Galaxy have it now at midfield, pushing forward to Brugman, trying to find Jovalic. Back out it goes to Brugman. This time Pooj inside 30 yards from goal. Back out it goes to Edwards. Efrain Alvarez over to Memo Rodriguez as the Galaxy overload the left side. Alvarez along the end line tries to find Jovalic. Side of the six cleared out of play. This will be a throw in for the Galaxy. So the Galaxy outside in their first opportunity here overloaded one side to start the second half. Caceres ahead it goes to Rodriguez back to Pouge Edwards into Memo and this will be cleared away by Beloder towards midfield. Again, Caceres for the Galaxy. Pooj does well to settle back for Jalen Neal. He'll knock it on back to his goalkeeper, Jonathan Bond. In towards midfield that goes from Bond. This will be a foul against Sporting Kansas City. As Caceres was nudged from behind. This will be a handball, and it could be a yellow card against Kansas City as Ricky Pooj was playing this one forward. Pooj wants the yellow. Now we're getting a little more assistance from upstairs. Eric Tommy says no it was not intentional. Nonetheless free kick here for the Galaxy about five yards past the midfield strike. Brugman. Leerdam. Back it comes to Jalen Neal watched there by Agata. Alvarez one touch back to Leerdam once again all the way back to Jonathan Bond. He'll lift this one forward. Alvarez gets a touch and it goes out of play for a throw in. Touch last by Kansas City. Here's Ricky Pooj now. Back it goes to Brookman. I think Ricky wants to see a little more, more rotation up top from his players, his teammates, so he can find them. Here's Brookman. Taken off the ball by Agata. Neal with a clean that one up and does. It'll come on loose. Brookman brings it down. Able to push this forward to Memo Rodriguez. He'll go left side to Edwards. This looks better for the Galaxy. Edwards thinking about it for Efrain Alvarez. And the bending ball is cleared away by Beloder. To the near side it goes to Zussi. And he'll play it into midfield. This will be a foul against the Galaxy's Brookman. Armando Villarreal, our referee tonight. Pretty clean match to this point. He hasn't had to give anybody a caution. Had a couple of conversations, but that's about it. I think Kelvin Leardon was very fortunate. He didn't pick up a yellow card in the first half. Zussi. Watch there by Pooj. Come on back to Zussi. Has it one more time. He'll lift up the near side now. Agata able to bring it down towards the touchline. It'll come over to Roger Espinoza and not enough room. Throw in here Galaxy. Quickly taken by Edwards. You'll find Caceres. Delgado. On to the right. Clear Dom. Jalen Neal able to go forward. Brugman. Again Caceres. The Galaxy move past the stripe. Edwards you'll find. Ricky Pooj will go back to Brugman. And the Galaxy doing a better job of linking up passes and moving from touchline to touchline. This will come on forward. Delgado over to Efrain Alvarez on the right side. He's got Mark on the wing. He'll find him now. Three defenders around the play. It'll come on out. Leerdam, Brugman. A lot more patience now for the Galaxy as they work to keep the ball in the offensive end. Pass mid mid midfield and into the offensive third. This is a better start from the first half. Remember the first six minutes of the first half it was a firing line and the Galaxy were fortunate to keep Kansas City off the board. Foul here against Ricky Pooj. He'll be a handball. He thought it hit off his chest. He has a few words for the referee. It'll be a free kick. Look 
looked like it might have hit off of his left hand and Puj not happy about it. Leibold plays it back to Fontas. Beloder now for Kansas City. Just shy of the center circle. So come on forward. And all the way back. Galaxy push everybody behind the midfield stripe. No defending high tonight. And that will make Kansas City uncomfortable. They're not a team that likes to be on possession for a lot. They like to win the ball and go direct to goal. And having to build out of the back on their own is something they're not very happy to do, at least comfortable doing. Ball will go left side here. Eric Tommy, the captain of the club, plays it on back. Voltaire able to go forward now. Here comes the early ball into the box, cleared out by Jalen Neal. Kansas City keeps it alive. Voltaire, the big left footed shot blocked. Jovalich dropped the free kick. Galaxy quickly the restart. Memo Rodriguez. Puj making the run down the middle. Has it now. Turns away from one defender. Gets away from the second. Espinosa. Brugman with a cheeky heel pass over to Puj. He'll take it down the middle. Watch there by Shelton. And taken off the ball by Shelton. Puj needs a little better awareness of who's around him and who's chasing him down. Back the other way. Brugman wins it back for the Galaxy. And having said that, Kansas City needed better ball awareness there. Here's Memo Rodriguez now for the Galaxy. Nobody making the late run down the middle has to turn it back out. Pooch, Brugman, Leardong. And all the way back to the stripe, Jalen Neal. Caceres this time around. The Galaxy get numbers forward, and Kansas City drops everybody back. Caceres, Puj, again to Martin Caceres. Memo Rodriguez. In the center goes Delgado. The one time pass forward to Jovalich as the Galaxy start to ping the ball around the field. Good job here by Rodriguez, keeping it alive for the Galaxy. Comes over to Delgado, plays it on into Alvarez. On his right foot, his shot to go blocked and cleared away over the end line. Corner kick here for the Galaxy, their first one of the night. Efrain Alvarez had a great opportunity breaking it on goal, but he was closed right at the final moment. Had the first touch, his shot actually saved by Pools Camp as it got caught between his legs, and the rebound came through for Leibold, who just cleared it out. Here's the corner kick, comes on in. Edwards gets on the end of it, over the bar and out of play. Goal kick. So the Galaxy now knocking on the door. Better start in this second half than the first. Galaxy fans, 2023 season ticket memberships are available now. Season ticket memberships include brand new benefits, including access to the MLS Pass on the Apple TV app. Don't miss out on a moment of home action. The LA Galaxy are for LA by LA. Join now by calling 877 galaxy or visit lagalaxy.com forward slash season tickets for more information. 0-0, 55th minute of this one. Here comes Kansas City on the attack. Voltaire pushing forward. It'll come on back. Leibold. Back up the wing it'll go. Good job by the Galaxy's Kelvin Leardom forcing shallow way back. And a nice job by Delgado as well. Galaxy doing a better job being compact here to start the second half and forcing Kansas City to make decisions. Tommy lifting towards the near side. Zussi is there, watched by Edwards. He'll try to go to the byline, get the cross away, back post, the header down in front, comes loose at the top of the six, and Brookman able to clear it out. In the meantime, the Galaxy have a player down, Kelvin Leardom. Looks to be a head injury for him, and the trainers will come out and take a look. On the replay here, Zussi was able to get a good cross away that was flighted towards that back post. And maybe Agata got him with an elbow as he went up to try to win that ball in the air. As we look at the replay once again, I think that's what it was. The left elbow as he just tried to jump up to get it. Got right in to Calvin Leardom. Final is now in from Major League Soccer from earlier tonight. Columbus and Toronto play to a 1-1 draw. Philadelphia wins 1-0 against Chicago. New York City 
defeated Miami 1 0 at Yankee Stadium. D.C. and Orlando tied 1 1. Cincinnati, a win at home against Seattle in their first meeting ever in Cincinnati. 1 0 the final there. Congratulations to Pat Noonan and company in that one. Vancouver and Dallas played to a 1 1 draw, and it was Atlanta over Charlotte 3 0 earlier today. Here, 0 0 now in the 56th minute. Calvin Leardon being checked out, making sure he's okay. They'll have to go off for now. Caesar rolled down, the Galaxy trainer, putting him through the protocol. Greg Vanny having a discussion along the near side. A little more direction there with Ricky Pooge. Ricky's having a hard time tonight in terms of getting forward when he gets forward he's being chased down and whether that's a lack of communication or a lack of awareness or a lack of running off the ball by his teammates he's getting caught and closed and his artistry is being cut short by any number of those actions not ta being taken his awareness lack of communication or running off the ball. Any one of those pieces right there is slowing Ricky down tonight from being able to really impress offensively as the Galaxy have few and far between have had opportunities in against John Poole's camp. Only one in the first half. They did have one moments ago when Efrain Alvarez's shot was saved by Poole's camp and then cleared by Leibold over the line for a corner kick. Leardam on his feet. He'll come off for now. Trots off towards the near side. Looks to be okay. The fans at Children's Mercy Park not happy with the delay. I don't think they're booing Leardam. I don't think they're happy with the delay in getting things back up and running. Galaxy are back at home for the first time this season on the 18th when they take on Vancouver. Tickets are available at 8773 Galaxy as play continues now. Here's Kyrie Shelton on the near side. It comes Espinosa able to play it on out to Zussi. Back to Voloder. He'll push it past the stripe, squares it on over. Fontas. Out the left side it goes. Libel. Shallow eight. Relatively quiet as Leardon is back on, and we are 11 aside. Voltaire, and on the left side for Kansas City, it goes once again. Leardon defending on the play. The cross down low towards the spot. Sheldon back to goal. Can't get the shot away. Here's the shot from distance that was deflected, and it goes out. I believe it was touched last, though, by Kansas City. And it's going to be a goal kick. Voltaire had a clean look for goal here, and he played it right into his own player. Kyrie Sheldon and out of play it goes for the goal kick Edwards right into Zussi and the turnover and here comes Kansas City again Shelton pushing forward top of the box it goes it got a left footed ball to goal and over the bar and out another goal kick and again turnover at midfield two passes shot on goal and the Galaxy need to be careful with that because at some point they're going to put it on frame. So as we're in the 60th minute here. As it comes out the near side for Edwards. I'm sure Greg Vanny's thinking about what moves he may make. Here in the second half and for that matter he's saying I'm 0 0 so I'll probably stay this way as long as I can. Here's Shallowy on the left side now. Plays into the area. Got it with the chance. Shelton with the chance. Another ball to goal. Saved by Bond. As it was topped by Tommy. And Jonathan Bond was able to reach over to his right side and just touch the ball into his gut. And he'll pick up. Agata with a miss right in front of Caceres. And then the ball bounced out to Tommy and he topped it. Right into Jonathan Bond and Kansas City still has not scored this season. It's not for a lack of chances especially in this game. 
Jonathan Bond I think he's at nine saves now on the night. Here's Zussi for Kansas City. Back out it goes to Shelton lays it off to Voltaire. Left side this time around Leibold able to play it forward shallow we back to Leibold. He's got Voltaire if he wants him. It'll go back to the stripe Fontes squares it on over Voloder. Again. Zussi and the Galaxy looking good defensively here a good defensive posture forcing Kansas City on the wings Edwards though whiffs on Shelton that comes into the box I got to look at a turn and shoot and can't Tommy on his right foot the shot blocked by Neal the loose ball comes to Espinosa back to the top of the area Tommy again looking for that right foot plays it on the left side here's shallow we left corner of the box chips it on in a goddess header and it's wide of the far post and a goal kick and the Galaxy living dangerously right now in the 62nd minute. Gotta able to get on this one and this snap header not enough as it goes out of play for the goal kick. Turnovers right now for the Galaxy are the killer. Good start to the second half but over the last five minutes or so too many turnovers in the middle third have led to led to good chances for the home side sporting Kansas City. The goal kick by Jonathan Bond headed out of play over the near side touch. So Shelton is done. So Johnny's comes on for Sporting Kansas City. He'll go on the right side. Brugman. Back to Caceres, lobs this one forward. Jovalich on the first ball. It'll come on back to Brookman, though. Has it just shy of the stripe. He'll ping it ahead to Mark Edwards. Uh, Delgado, I should say. And it comes on over to Efrain Alvarez. Again, Brookman, this time to Pooch. Trying to find the shot. Pooch thought he was fouled. The referee says no. We'll go back the other way. Here comes Johnny's. On the near side, he'll push past the stripe. Galaxy do have numbers back. Kosaris watching him. Brookman there as well. Agata will take it into the area along the near side. Was he offside? Jalen Neal thought he was. Now Johnny's on his left foot. His shot blocked by Brookman. And now the flag goes up for offside and possession to the LA Galaxy. Little delay call there, especially that deep into the penalty area. Once the shot was blocked, the flag went up. Ian Anderson on the near side tonight as the AR. Kosaris now for the Galaxy. He'll get to about 35 yards away from goal. Puts on the brake, squares it into center for Brugman. Lifts it on over to Memo Rodriguez, who checks on back. Rodriguez has to play it back to Jalen Neal. Ahead it comes again, Brugman. This time around, Kosaris. The Galaxy look to get to midfield now. Rodriguez. Again, Brugman. Right side it goes, Leardom. Delgado making the run into the channel and onto the wing. It comes up to him from Alvarez. Watch there by Leibold. The one time cross into the area gets over the top of Jovalich and then headed out by Zussi. And the Galaxy get themselves a corner kick out of it. Good build up that time for the LA Galaxy and a good set play opportunity this time around for the Galaxy. And here come three in a moment for LA. Tyler Boyd, Preston Judd, and Chris Mavinga. And I wonder. Who Mavinga will replace, Caceres or Jalen Neal? The 19-year-old Jalen Neal, you think he can go all night and has played well. Here's the cross into the area off the corner kick. It comes to the top of the box. Pooj, the shot to go blocked. Caceres with a chance from 25, and that's off of a body, but no foul. It goes right side. Alvarez on his left foot, fires to go blocked. And it'll come loose back the other way. And here comes Sporting Kansas City on the counterattack. Shallowy getting forward. Alvarez getting back defensively. He'll cut in towards center. Lays this one off for Espinosa. Again, Shallowy now 25 from goal. Fire saved by Bond. And he holds on to it. Save number 10 for Jonathan Bond. Remember last week Sporting Kansas City had 11 shots on goal that were saved of course in a 0-0 draw with Colorado 
Here come the Galaxy back the other way now. Delgado lays it off to Efrain Alvarez. Alvarez needs to do better with that one. I think he was fouled or touched from behind. Might have been stepped on. Play's been stopped. And a delayed foul called in the Galaxy's favor. I think our referee decided to give the Galaxy advantage, but once the ball went backwards, he called the foul. Here come the substitutions now for the Galaxy. Leerdam is leaving the match. Replaced by Chris Mavinga. Jovalich is done. Replaced by Preston Judd. And Boyd will come on. For Alvarez. So Boyd will go on the right side. I think Mavinga goes in as a center back and Jalen Neal goes to the right. As I'll take a look at this in a moment. Boyd goes on the right side. In the meantime. So Radoya comes off for Sporting Kansas City as they've made a substitution as well. He makes his debut for Sporting Kansas City. As we take a look at this, the way the Galaxy look, Caceres is on the right side. Jalen Neal remains as a center back. Mavinga goes in as the left-sided center back. Working with Edwards. And it comes over to Edwards who lifts it long. Ahead it goes to Preston Judd. Judd now working again it's his defender. Able to shake him for now, plays it on him back. Good job by Preston Judd. Delgado now to Brugman. Thinking about the shot, he'll go right side instead. Boyd tries to play it across in front. Delgado with the late run, and bodies collide, and I think that's a foul against Mark Delgado and a free kick for Sporting Kansas City. Voltaire holding on to the lower part of his back here, and, and maybe it was more of the fact that when he fell down I think he fell on the on the feet backside of one of his players so he got he got a boot to the backside let's put it that way 0 0 as we enter into the 69th minute the LA Galaxy faces off against the Vancouver Whitecaps Saturday March 18th 730 for the home opener presented by SoCal VW dealers at Dignity Health Sports Park Tickets available at LAGalaxy.com. 0 0 in this one. It'll come on loose at midfield. Brugman will win it back for the Galaxy. However, here comes Kansas City back the other way, though, up the left side. It comes in towards center. Shallow way. On to the right. Johnny's. Top of the Galaxy penalty area over to Zussi. His cross into the six, cleared away by Brugman. Comes over near side and Zussi has it again. Watch there by Rodriguez. On the return ball to Zussi, the cross in, the header to goal by Agata, and batted down by Bond. It was going to be wide nonetheless, and Jonathan Bond will pick up. Galaxy got caught a bit there. Zussi with a good one time cross, and Agata was basically going away from goal on his header. And while it redirected towards the area of the goal, it was wide. Galaxy try to work the right side. Tyler Boyd is brought down. Foul, free kick. Leibold got into him. And Greg Vanny was talking about Tyler Boyd this week and said, you know, he's working his way back into match fitness. He's fit. But he hasn't played in quite some time, and so it's going to take a little while for him to find his game completely. And that's where he is right now, and that's why I think he came on when he did and not started. Ball goes far side, and here comes Sporting Kansas City. Roya. Another ball top of the area this time comes on loose. Edwards with the clearance. Ahead it goes to Pouge. Plays it in towards Mark Delgado. He'll take it down the middle of the park. Looking for Preston Judd. Plays it into his stride. And this ball will be cleared away by Voloder. But that was a good ball on the part of Mark Delgado. And a good run by Preston Judd. He's forcing Kansas City to be honest defensively. Here's Pouge now for the Galaxy. Just past the stripe. Knocks it back to Brugman. Right side to Caceres. 
Ahead it goes to Boyd. Again, back to Kosaris, and that's good about the Galaxy right now. They're being patient and saying, okay, you want to give us some time? We'll catch our breath, and we'll keep the ball on our foot. Puj plays this one forward through Delgado. Needed to do better on that one, Mark. Back it goes to the goalkeeper, pulls camp. Delgado will put the pressure on the keeper. Out the near side it comes, Azusi. He'll play it on forward. It'll come on loose, and Edwards will win it back, and he's brought down by Johnny's. Free kick for the Galaxy. Quickly taken. Brugman plays it toward Boyd. That could have been better, that pass. And the Galaxy need to get back defensively. Here comes the counterattack as Kansas City will take it right down the middle of the park. It comes over to the near side. Johnny's now trying to find it with his left foot. Puts it on his right. Fires near post. It's wide. And this was deflected, says our referee. Corner kick for Sporting Kansas City. Or was it? No. Goal kick for the Galaxy. Good run there by Leibold. And the shot by Johnny's, I do not believe, was touched by Mavinga. Possession Galaxy here, 72nd minute. Jalen Neal. Mavinga this time around. Able to play it forward to Rodriguez. Good ball back for Pooj. Was he brought down? Our referee says play on. Advantage to the Galaxy as they go forward. Delgado's got Boyd on the right side. He'll find him. Here comes Tyler Boyd. Right corner of the area. Trying to put it on his left foot. You have a go at goal. Blocked in front and cleared away by Voloder. This ball will go up the right side. Unfortunately, Delgado was in an offside position. Will not make a play on the ball. Leibold will pick up for Kansas City. He'll lift it forward. Shallowy touches it on back, and the Galaxy will put themselves in the defensive posture here and keep the game in front of them. Zussi on the near side. Plays it ahead into Agata on the wrong side of him. Jalen Neal able to knock it ahead to Gaston Brugman. It'll come on forward to Delgado. Caceres. Boyd is there on the right. Back out again, Brugman. Pouge. And Kosteris one more time. Again on the wing, Boyd. Pushing forward, watch there by Shallowy. He'll cut in towards center, squares it in for Memo Rodriguez. Rodriguez turns it on back. He'll find Pouge, plays it over to Brugman. He's got Edwards on the left if he wants him, he'll find him. Edwards working on Zussi now. Second defender and Johnny's is there. Memo Rodriguez, back out it goes. The Galaxy just pinging the ball around and slowly making their way downfield. The pass by Pouge, though, not good enough. And back the other way comes Sporting Kansas City. They're working on the left side. Shallowy is there, getting up that left wing, looking to get across the way right into Caceres. Good positioning there by Martin Caceres as that ball was intended to pull back to Agata. Edwards puts on the brakes. Brugman back to Mavinga. Pouge again, Chris Mavinga. Wants Memo Rodriguez to check back, finds him. Good ball ahead to Edwards. This is good for the Galaxy. Edwards pushing forward. Three defenders converging on him. A fourth defender converging on him. It comes on loose. And John Pools camp able to pick up. Edwards says he's injured, and he may have gone head first into the surface here. And play's been stopped. Caesar roll down will come on. And here's a look at it again on the replay we have. I'm not sure exactly what happened on the play. But Edwards is being checked out by the Galaxy training staff. And of course, the fans not happy at Children's Mercy Park. I understand that. Soccer fans, secure your 2023 partial plan now. Partial plans include the March 18th home opener, the April 16th match against LAFC, plus four games of your choice. This is a great plan. Partial plans also include 10% discount at the team store and pre-sale access and discounts for the MLS playoffs. Email ticket plans at LAGalaxy.com. That's ticket plans at LAGalaxy.com or visit LAGalaxy.com forward slash tickets forward slash partial plan today.
Yes, it's a mouthful. Kansas City ready in another substitution here in a moment. And they had a player that was also a little banged up. Might be libeled, I believe. Edwards will go off and he'll come back on here in a moment. Probably more winded than anything else, but he did a good job. Ben Sweat will be coming on and he will play on that left side defensively. And I think what Peter Ramiz is saying is Preston Judd and Tyler Boyd are over overloading that left side of his defense could be a problem. He needs to put some fresh legs out there to deal with at least Boyd. And then he'll have his center backs deal with Preston Judd. Seventy seventh minute here in a zero zero match. Here's sweat on possession as we continue. He'll lift it towards the near side. Edwards is back out there as well. Johnny's gets on the ball, keeps it in play, banks it back to Zussi, able to play it one time forward. Collected this time by Voltaire. Out the left side it goes to sweat. Force back defensively. Good defensive posture here by the Galaxy of a loader. Now Fontas. And towards the near side, Zussi one more time. Good job defensively by the Galaxy, forcing this ball out of play, but it's going to be a foul, I believe, against Brugman. Voltaire. They'll work the left channel. Good work there by Boyd winning it back for the Galaxy. Ahead to Delgado. He'll find Pouge. This is promising for LA. It goes to the left for Memo Rodriguez. Preston Judd calling for the ball. And Rodriguez will take the shot. It's deflected up high into the air. Cleared out. Ahead it goes to Tommy. He'll play it back to Ben Sweat on that left side who will push into midfield. The Galaxy need to be careful now. This late in the match they cannot get stretched and right now they just did. It goes on to the left side. Sweat will get the cross away and headed away by Edwards. Tommy trying to get to this one. He does. Out efforted Delgado that time around. Now Tommy will take the shot. It's blocked by Brugman. It'll come on loose. Towards the right side it comes. Zussi bends it to the back post and this one will find its way out of play off of Shallowy for the goal kick. So the Galaxy in their last rush downfield could not finish the sequence like they wanted. And for this point on now, 79 minutes in, I think the Galaxy when they do get downfield, the sequence needs to end with a shot that allows for either a goal kick or a save or something like that or a goal obviously. But if it turns into a turnover the legs are heavy right now for the Galaxy find themselves laboring to get back and they get stretched and that's what they can't afford. Here comes Kansas City now on the near side Johnny's with a cross into the six knocked away by Mavinga corner kick for Sporting Kansas City. On the right side of the go on this corner kick. 0 0 80th minute. Maybe Yuri Rossell, maybe Daniel Aguirre. Aguirre is ready to go for the Galaxy and most likely will get a call here in a moment. And I wonder if he's going to spell Mark Delgado. Because I think Delgado is on fumes. Tommy plays this one into the air. He gets through Edwards, goes to the top of the box, a shot to goal, and it goes across the six and out of play. Goal kick here for the Galaxy. Ben Sweat got on the end of it with a one time left footed ball. So 
So Memo Rodriguez will leave the game and Daniel Laguerre will come on in. And Rodriguez has burned a few miles today in this match. I don't believe Aguirre will find himself on the wing. He'll probably position himself in with Brugman, allowing for Puj to release a bit downfield. The goal kick comes down to midfield. The Galaxy have it again. Here's Bru Judd. Able to go right side to Caceres. Judd will get forward. It comes on back to Brugman. Ahead to Delgado. Brugman once again. This is promising for the Galaxy as it goes left side. Edwards is there. Watch there by Zussi. Gets the cross away. Did that hit a hand? It'll be a corner kick for the Galaxy, but it looked like both arms went up on Graham Zussi. Corner kick LA and not a free kick. It would not have been a penalty kick because he was outside the box for sure. Daniel Laguerre is going to take the corner kick for the Galaxy. So you got Preston Judd in the area who does well. Jalen Neal, two biggest players for the Galaxy. Not a very big team. Mavinga is up there as well. Aguirre plays into the area this time around. Boxed away by Pools Camp. Puj will bring it down. He'll set it on, settle on back to Mavinga. He'll go all the way back to his goalkeeper, Jonathan Bond. 83rd minute, and we're still 0 0. Delgado. Ahead to Aguirre. Judd wants this ball. Aguirre's not seeing him at the moment. Plays it up the left wing looking for Edwards. This will be cleared on out. But the Galaxy have it again. Ricky Pouge over to Brugman. Caceres on the right side. Boyd is there right at the wing. He'll send it in the box trying to find Judd. Cleared away. Delgado now for the Galaxy. Aguirre. Pouge. Good ball ahead this time around. Delgado ushers on the left side. Edwards back out it goes. Aguirre squared on over to Pouge. He's going to switch it on the right side for Boyd. Maybe too much air on that one as Ben Sweat wins it and it's cleared out. Comes ahead to Tommy. He knocks it back to Fontas. And on the left side it goes to Ben Sweat. And here comes Kansas City. 84th minute and we're still 0-0. Galaxy absorbed a lot in the first half. They've been much better in the second half. More method to the madness. They've kept the game in front of them, and they've taken their chances when they've showed them to them. In other words, they've become aware of the opportunities. Here's Sweat on the left side for Kansas City. And again, the Galaxy in a good defensive posture, getting back and in front of the ball. It'll go right side to Zussi now. Johnny's working on Edwards gets his cross away deflected and Jonathan Bond had to make a play on the ball to make sure it went out and it did. This will be a corner kick for Kansas City now. Deflection by Edwards and that ball looked like it was going to at least hit the post and a good job on the part of Jonathan Bond just batting it away. So Johnny's will take the corner kick 85th minute 0 0 here this ball should swing away from Jonathan Bond played in towards the spot goes up high into the air at the top of the six it's still loose in the Galaxy penalty box back out it goes for Johnny's and the Galaxy to break out now Johnny's into the area it goes towards the backside now the penalty box shallow we sweat about 30 yards from goal and it goes left side. Kansas City a little bit heavy legged. Here's the shot by Shalloway, saved by Bond, right on the goalkeeper. Looked like Redoya had an opportunity there, but he couldn't get the ball out of his feet. And then Shalloway from about 24, right on to Bond. And now Bond out the right side, not a good ball. Another turnover here. Here's Shallowy. Can he get the shot away? It squirts loose in the penalty area, and the Galaxy will have it. Bond will collect. And it'll be possession to the Galaxy. And it might have been an offside against Kansas City. 
You know, the inaugural League's Cup tournament kicks off this summer. The LA Galaxy square up against Liga MX side Club Leon on Tuesday, July 25th, and play host to Vancouver Whitecaps on Saturday, July 29th at Dignity Health Sports Park. Get your tickets now at LAGalaxy.com. Here's Pooj. Can't find the second ball, though. Comes out front. Collected here by Tommy. On the left side, it goes. Shallowy trying to turn the corner on Caceres. Gets the cross away. A Gary towards his own goal. And Jonathan Bond will smother it. Side of his six-yard box. He'll walk to the top of the area. Bond will. Roll it out to himself and play it out the near side. Mavinga ahead it goes to Edwards. Plays in the midfield. That's broken up. Comes out to Zussi. Voltaire knocks it on back to Fontas. Near side again to Zussi. Johnny's this time around. Watched by Edwards. Good job by Aguirre to help out. Voltaire right at center. Has some room. Lays this one off. He'll get it on back, plays it top of the box. Neil pokes it away, comes out to Brugman. Here's Pooj, tried to play that one forward and right into the defender. Otherwise, he would have had Preston Judd making a run into the offensive end. Need to be cleaner on that first ball out. It has not been good enough tonight. Neil with a header on the top of his box, able to clear it on out. Comes out to Delgado, and he's dispossessed. And Kansas City have possession again. This will come on loose. Aguirre steps on through his tackle. Plays it on the right side and finds Boyd. They'll try to get into the attack. The Galaxy will. Boyd has some room. Should take it all the way on his own if he should. Plays it on to Delgado. Now Boyd has it. This is promising. Plays it on through. Fontas gets in front of Preston Judd. And it's cleared out. Radoya. Over towards the near side. And here comes Kansas City. Zussi. 88th minute. Ahead it goes to Johnny's. Gets away from Edwards. Closed down by Brugman. Edwards is there as well. That ball may have hit off a hand, but the referees say play on. Aguirre this time for the Galaxy. Delgado. Back to Caceres. Brugman. Brugman's been the best Galaxy midfielder tonight. Edwards goes down. And he's holding on his left hamstring. And he's going to have to leave the match, I believe. And the Galaxy will look over to the bench. The fans at Children's Mercy Park not happy with that move. He'll be stretched out a bit. But at worst case scenario, he might drop a Gary back to left back. Played a little right back for the Galaxy in preseason, but left back, no chase Gasper, who's coming back from a groin injury. He didn't make the trip. And Edwards was holding on to that hamstring there and just kicked it out due to the injury. And sure, yes, sportsmanship too going on. But for the Galaxy, what type of substitution can they make here? Who is available? Maybe Yuri Rossell. As I look at the substitutions list that are available here for I think you might just put Eric Zavaleta in and play with another center back. And that's all there's to it. Jonathan Bond will pick up in the box rolls it out to Jalen Neal 90th minute here. Look for four or five minutes of stoppage time I imagine. Pooj Brugman back to Pooj now. Out the near side it goes to Aguirre. Galaxy playing a man down all the way back to his goalkeeper Bond who has to collect it outside his box. He'll just lift it long. It comes ahead this time to Rodoya. Good work by Brugman. Wins it back for the Galaxy. Ahead it goes to Pooj. Zussi did a good job of stepping in front there. Seven minutes of stoppage time. Johnny's now for Sporting Kansas City. Played back to Fontas on the left side. It goes to Ben Sweat. Shallowy. 
All the way back defensively. Voloder, Galaxy drop everybody to 40 yards away from their goal. Voloder again at the stripe. Nobody within 15 yards of him. Fontas. This will come on forward. Agata has to play it back. He's going to switch on to the right side. Possession for Sporting Kansas City. Tommy. Johnny's now. Good work by Aguirre. He'll just usher it up the wing, but nobody there for the Galaxy. Tommy one more time. Squares it in towards center. Back out the right side. It goes to Johnny's. Tommy one more time along the end line. He keeps it in play. Good work by Brugman this time around off the stick. Goal kick. Went off the flag and out of play. Touch last by Kansas City. Goal kick for the LA Galaxy. So Yuri Roussel makes a homecoming of sorts as he returns back to Kansas City and makes his Galaxy debut of 2023. I'm going to guess Rossell goes in in midfield as a defensive midfielder and Aguirre will hang out on the left side the rest of the match. Comes out the near side Aguirre able to hit it forward. Galaxy will get the throw in on the near side here. Rossell back to Mavinga. He'll get another throw in. About five minutes to go in this one. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. Long throw by Aguirre. Ahead it goes to Preston Judd. Turns it into space trying to turn the corner. Forcing Voloder back to his goalkeeper Poles camp. One thing about Preston Judd, he is a horse to deal with. And if he can get more opportunities and hone his craft just a bit more, he can be a very good forward in this league. Now, honing your craft just a bit more is a tall task now at this point. But making his second appearance for the Major League Soccer Galaxy. He's got a little room, a little time to do so. Fontas goes left side to Sweat. 94th minute, this ball ahead to Shallowy. In the Galaxy penalty area along the end line. It comes on loose top of the six. Brugman is there. He'll take it outside the box. Able to play it right side to Boyd. In the midfield, Boyd still on possession. And the ball needs to get away a little bit sooner. And I think Boyd is telling Preston Judd, hey, show for the ball. Don't play with the offside line. And I think that's what Preston Judd was doing that time. Foul here at midfield. That'll be a free kick for Sporting Kansas City. A good set play opportunity. About 40 yards away from the Galaxy goal. Voltaire with a quick restart, though. Shallowy not happy about that. Sweat. It'll come on to the far side. Into the penalty area by Tommy and right onto the goalkeeper, Jonathan Bond. You'll walk it to the top of the box. About two and a half minutes to go in this one. Bond lifting long downfield. This will go over everyone's head. And back defensively collected by Kansas City. Zussi. Back it goes to Veloder. Judd trying to quarter things off. And he works with Brugman to get it back. Puj back into Preston Judd. Judd can't find the right foot. But he'll get the corner kick out of this. Good work by Preston Judd as he tried to play it through Veloder to his right foot for a shot. Veloder had to make a play on the ball. And the Galaxy get a corner kick out of this. Touch of a loader last off of his knee. And the Kansas City fans not happy. Daniel Aguirre will take his time. 
And if I'm the Galaxy, I wonder, do I go for goal here? Fourth corner of the night for the Galaxy. Eight for Kansas City. This one played into the box. Comes over to the far side. Rossell plays it on in. Ball cleared back in towards midfield. Caceres gets on the first ball. Good work here by the Galaxy getting on back. Rossell will run it down along the end line. Fontas has to make a play on the ball. Good work on the part of Rossell, forcing Kansas City to play on it. And it goes into midfield, closed down by Delgado and out of play. This will be a throw in for Kansas City inside the final minute unofficially. 0 0 at Children's Mercy Park. This ball closed down, but Sweat will have it again. Delgado defending on the play, but Ben Sweat forced back. Long ball into the Galaxy defense. Agata is there. Jalen Neal with him as well. Agata trying to cut on back. Neal forces it out. Here's the attempt into the area by Shalawi. Closed by Neal. The cross to goal. Boxed away by Bond. And was it out? It's going to be a corner kick here. Bond says his hand was out on the cross. And Jonathan... You got to be careful there. This is going to be the final kick of the match, I believe. Everybody in the area for Sporting Kansas City flight it towards the top of the box, cleared away by Pooj. Our referee puts his left arm in the air, points to midfield, and this match has come to an end as the Galaxy absorbed, 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 gave themselves a chance in the second half, but they earn a very good point away from home in a 0-0 draw with Sporting Kansas City. Galaxy come home, earning their first point of the season. 0-0 at KC. The postgame show is coming up next. Stay with us. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year, powered by Herbalife Nutrition the official nutrition company of the L.A. Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save for details. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop, but you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the L.A. Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown L.A., St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. Hey, L.A. Galaxy fans. Score at Yamaba Resort and Casino at San Manuel and come experience world-class gaming, dining, and entertainment. As Southern California's home of huge prizes and jackpots, Yamaba is also the place to be for amazing concerts at Yamaba Theater. Upcoming shows include Maluma, Janet Jackson, New Kids on the Block, and many others. Get your tickets today at yamabatheater.com or the casino box office. Must be 21 to enter. Please gamble responsibly. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer, steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich, Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled-up sleeve. 
Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly. Imported by Crown Imports, Chicago, Illinois. Welcome to the LA Galaxy Post Game. This LA Galaxy match has been brought to you by Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. By Herbalife Nutrition, nutrition for a better life. And by Wingstop, the flavor of the LA Galaxy. Order now at wingstop.com. Children's Mercy Park was the site this evening in Kansas City, Kansas. A cold night, rain throughout the day, but it held up tonight, and the Galaxy get a hard-fought point away from home in a 0-0 draw with Sporting Kansas City. A game in the first half where Kansas City peppered the Galaxy. Eight saves in the first half alone for Jonathan Bond in that first half. But in the second half, the Galaxy leveled things out a bit. Kansas City did have the more aggressive play in the second half. But the Galaxy controlled the match. They never found themselves really in a position of emergency defending or giving up incredible opportunities in front of goal. Kansas City ended the night with 19 shots, 11 of them on goal, 11 saves for Jonathan Bond. Kansas City had 11 shots saved on them last week. And Kansas City still looking for their first goal on the season. Having said that, in the second half, instead of the one opportunity the Galaxy had in the first, the Galaxy had then five more opportunities in the second half and almost opened the goal scoring early on in the second half with an opportunity for Efrain Alvarez that was saved, a leg save, by the goalkeeper John Poolskamp. Alvarez later had another opportunity at the top of the box. Ricky Pooj, who fought through this match to stay on the field and be productive for his teammates throughout the 90 minutes. He was isolated, unfortunately, going forward and found himself closed down on a number of opportunities in and around midfield and past the stripe when maybe he was overtouching the ball or maybe there was lack of communication from his teammates that he was being chased from behind and caught from behind or the other thing that I mentioned during the broadcast was maybe his teammates weren't doing enough running off the ball to show opportunities to pass the ball going forward and thus Ricky was being closed down. Defensively, though, I thought the tandem of the center backs of Jalen Neal and Martin Caceres did just fine. I thought on the right side, Kelvin Leardom, when he stayed home, was doing just fine throughout most of the match. And I know that Raheem Edwards had a difficult game in week one at FC Dallas. It was a tough game on him, but I thought he rebounded well in this one. And when you put up a zero, having conceded 19 shots towards your net, you have to be pleased with that. And certainly, Jonathan Bond, do I have to say it now? Let's say it now. The man of the match is brought to you by Herbal Life Nutrition. Nutrition for a better life, that would be Jonathan Bond. And we'll get you the save of the match in a moment. But this game tonight galvanized the Galaxy early on in this season. They can concede shots. They can get overrun at times but still put a clean sheet on the scoreboard. They did not expose themselves in the back. They did not put themselves in situations where counterattacks found the goalkeeper, Jonathan Bond, by himself in goal with no defenders around him. And in that regard, in that regard, this was a very good performance from the LA Galaxy on the road in a very difficult place historically for this club to play in and earn a point away. 0-0 zero, zero the final. We'll get you the save of the match. We'll get you all the scores in Major League Soccer and we'll set you up for what is next right after these words. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year. Powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. 
power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save for details. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the L.A. Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown L.A., St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com slash save for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer, steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich, Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage on their rolled-up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, brewed for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly. Imported by Crown Imports in Chicago, Illinois. So the Galaxy now get to go to the locker room, warm up a little bit, get on an airplane, come back home. But they come back a little banged up. Raheem Edwards, hamstring injury as he left the match late. Hopefully it's something minor that was more of fatigue and more of maybe gamesmanship, possibly, perhaps. Uh, let's hope it's that because the Galaxy right now don't have his backup, Chase Gasper. Not able to go with the groin, wasn't on the road trip. At right back, they don't have a right back at the moment. Kelvin Leardom is feeling in and doing a good job of that. And he took a knock in this match as well. Left the match after taking, uh, well, worked really hard and took a couple of knocks. So we'll see where these guys stand when they get back home and get ready for Vancouver. The Galaxy is still a little bit thin, waiting somewhere on some reinforcements and waiting on their MVP. Chicharito Hernandez still not able to go with his hamstring injury to start the season. Two to five weeks was that injury. We're heading into week three now, so we'll have a, a better understanding of where he is coming back. Douglas Costa hasn't played a minute this season either due to his calf injury. We'll see where he is at in the week leading up to the Galaxy's home opener against Vancouver. The Save of the Match is brought to you by Spectrum Mobile, the fastest growing mobile provider in the nation. 11 saves. 11 saves for Jonathan Bond in this one. There are plenty to pick from, and I think for me, the best save of the night happened in the first half with Voltaire firing a big left-footed shot from about 30 yards from goal, and Jonathan Bond having to go up and bat the ball over the bar keeping the score level at 0-0. A big night for Jonathan Bond. Certainly he is our man of the match. And next up for the Galaxy will be the Vancouver Whitecaps, who played at home and conceded an early goal to Dallas, and then they came back to earn a point at home in a 1-1 draw. Other finals, it was Atlanta over Charlotte by a count of 3-0 at Charlotte in front of 32,000 fans. Atlanta 
clearly outplayed the hometown Charlotte. Meanwhile, Cincinnati over Seattle, one nothing at home. D.C. and Orlando played to a 1-1 draw. That game at Audi Field. The Yankee Stadium, it was New York City, one Miami, nothing. Philadelphia at home against Chicago gets the win, one nothing over Chicago Fire. Toronto, 1-1 with Columbus, and it was Minnesota, 1-1 with Red Bull, playing with the orange ball there in Minnesota. Snow on the ground. Nashville shut out Montreal. 2-0 the final there. Games in progress now. Just starting the second half. It is Austin 2-1 on top of Real Salt Lake. Portland early on has taken a 1-0 lead against St. Louis. The debutants are 2-0 on the season, but right now they took it on the chin against Portland early in that match in the Pacific Northwest. And five minutes in, San Jose and Colorado are 0-0. Tonight at Children's Mercy Park in Kansas City, Kansas, the Galaxy earned their first point in a 0-0 draw with Sporting Kansas City. Joe Totino saying so long. And a reminder, the Galaxy are at home at Dignity Health Sports Park next Saturday when they open the home campaign against Vancouver. Tickets are available at LAGalaxy.com. Once again, the final score, Galaxy 0, Sporting Kansas City 0. Have a good night, everybody. In the course of a single game, LA Galaxy players will spend 90 minutes fighting for the ball, going on goal, sprinting, sliding, jogging backwards, running almost seven miles while maintaining an average heart rate of 160 beats per minute. And they'll perform at this world-class level 31 times a year, powered by Herbalife Nutrition, the official nutrition company of the LA Galaxy. To power up like a pro, contact your Herbalife independent distributor or visit Herbalife.com today. There's never been a better time to switch to Spectrum Mobile. You could save hundreds of dollars on your mobile bill. Plus, there are no added taxes, hidden fees, and no contracts. Try the Spectrum Mobile Savings Calculator today, and in three easy steps, you'll see how much you could save by switching. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save. Spectrum Internet required. Savings may vary. Restrictions apply. Visit SpectrumMobile.com save for details. You know you want that smoky, tangy, sweet, and spicy sauced and tossed wing stop. But you just brought a haul of groceries home from the store. It's cool. No one expects you to shop and cook in the same day. So let the flavor experts at Wingstop hook you up with mouth-watering wings, crispy tenders and thighs, fries and sides delivered to your door. You can always cook tomorrow. That's why the fridge was invented. Get it delivered at Wingstop.com. Dignity Health is the official health care partner of the LA Galaxy, including Glendale Memorial, St. Mary in Long Beach, Northridge Hospital, California Hospital in downtown LA, St. Bernardine and Community Hospital of San Bernardino. Across Dignity Health hospitals and care sites, the well-being of patients is always the priority. To learn about emergency services, health care, and healthy joints, you can visit DignityHealth.org slash SoCal. Dignity Health. Hello, human kindness. Omega Accounting Solutions is a proud partner of the LA Galaxy. Omega empowers your business with expert guidance on government tax incentives. If your small business survived the pandemic, you could be eligible for a tax refund of up to $26,000 per employee. The employee retention credit rewards businesses for paying staff during the pandemic. Omega ensures your business receives the maximum credit it deserves. Omega has over 15 years of experience and is a leading expert in the ERC and R&D tax credits. Discover if you you qualify in a free 10-minute ERC consultation. Visit OmegaTaxCredits.com for details. In 1925, Modelo began brewing beer for those who believe in better. A model beer steeped in the tradition of tireless effort. A rich Pilsner-style lager for those who wear their heart and heritage in their rolled-up sleeve. Since our first batch 94 years ago, to every bottle raised today, we've proved that it doesn't matter where you come from. It matters what you're made of. Modelo Especial, food for those with a fighting spirit. Drink responsibly. Imported by Crown Imports, Chicago, Illinois. 